hello friends welcome once again uh, to new session of our programming and that is in C uh, today we are going to talk about uh, character constant and string constant so how can we uh, uh, initialize some character constants and string constants in our C program so let's do it practically let's open code blocks so obviously it is title uh, this is people's directive directory head of file main function uh, first lesson stand single character constant uh, for the character we have to use data type char this is variable and whenever we put any constant value for the character we have to put inside single quote like it is shown here if we don't put enclose it inside single quote then it will be a mistake so it will highlight that so let's print it So whenever we enter display this character constant and we have to use this format is 5% C and this is the variable for which we are using this format is file. Let's put return. So let's compile it. So I saved it. So generators. let's run it so we can see here our output is C we can see our output is C so this is how we can work with single character using char data type and instead of using printf we can also use uh, put char for this We have already seen this in previous videos. So let's put the variable here. So this is also a method we can apply. So compiling, running. So we can say uh, C, it is being displayed. So it was for only one character, but suppose we have uh you can some many characters then how to do that for that we can use same but a little bit different here same data type we have to use there here is variable cs whenever we put uh, many characters we have to use double quote here yeah, i am putting So whenever we initialize some ST constants for given variable this then we have to put inside this double quote either we can put it same line or different line and uh, we must use this square bracket it is for some integer value here right now we are not using we can also put there for constant it uh, supports there if we put 100 maximum it can take or support 100 characters So for constant, either if you take 100 or less than that, it is okay. Or if you don't take, it is okay. So it works there. But uh, 
uh, if you input that then the computer must ask there actually you must uh, uh, put here some integer value uh, whenever we go for input but for this literal we get that constant value it is not mandatory after that we have to print it to print it we have to use here uh, format is issue five percent as and here is the variable where data is stored so let's compile it and run it uh, we can see here so whatever we have taken uh, this letter it is being displayed i a like programming so this is how it displays our string constant and this is how we can insulate some string constant and the character constant even if uh, we put here 100 it means it can support maximum 100 characters so once again it works there so look here i like program so it is displaying our output so for constant only this is optional this integer value is optional but whenever we go for input then this is mandatory we have to put it here uh, we can also use this value with the defined constant defined preprocessor reactive uh, instead of this print tab, we can also put ports function like is it uh, I'm writing CS so going to compile and run so look here same output as we have taken here I like programming just zooming in I like programming it is taken here it is displayed here so this is how we can work with the stick constant and the character constant it's very simple to understand uh, I think and I hope you understood how it works uh, if you have any confusion just put your confusion and the doubts in comment box uh, I'll try my best to make you more clear so once again I'll see you in next video till then take care and uh, stay blessed be positive and obviously share this video with your friends and don't forget to subscribe me